Every year, there are 40 million male chicks of this type of laying eggs from a total of 2.5 billion in the world will be destroyed. If it is known beforehand what gender the chicks will hatch from the eggs, then the farm can determine from the start which egg can continue to be hatched. Selection of the OC produce from hatch eggs on the basis of criteria such as gender determination, hatching, weight, and the OC conditions will be very helpful in breeding efforts because it can determine which the OC must be rejected and which the OC will be kept to be raised. In general, in the farm business, the TOC that is much expected is the female to be used as a potential term in an effort to reproduce eggs of population. Meanwhile, if the free-range chicken business is intended for meat production, then the DOC that is expected from the hatchery is the male. Conversely, if the production goal is laying hens, the target from hatching is female DOC. In laying hens, male chicks are undesirable as they do not lay eggs. Even fattening them is considered unprofitable because there is too little meat. The solution was that soon after hatching, the male chicks will be cured. Based on the background above, we think it is very important to know the gender of the chicken before it is hatched, so that we don't destroy existing life. Therefore, I'm Rafa Didia Revaza and I'm Rizky Batiar Habsara Putra from SMA Negeri Tiga Semarang. Have an idea to make egg grow, egg hen detection based on index and weight using Arduino. In this study, we innovate to make a Michelin tool to replace the perennial caliper in the form of an HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor and a wake sensor or load cell. It is intended that sorting takes place quickly and more accurately than using conventional tools. The type of research used in this study is research and development and quantitative descriptive, while the methods used in this research are experimental comparative and literature study methods. This study began by measuring the index and weight of 100 fertile chicken eggs. After that, the eggs will be incubated using an incubation tool for 21 days, and the data taken is the gender of each egg. Then, this data will be used as a calibration for our prototype database. We use the fan method to find out the gender of the DOC. Determination of gender by fan method, namely observing whether there is a lump in the cloaca of the HDOC. If there is a lump in the cloaca, it means male, and if there is no lump, then the gender is female. Then, for what procedure in this study include 1. A unit prototype manufacturing process. In this work, procedure is to prepare one unit of ESP32, one unit of load cell weight sensor, one unit of HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor, one unit of 18650 type battery, and one unit of 12C OLED display. Then a prototype will be made. Prototype testing. This includes work tests of load cell weighting sensor, work tests of HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor, and application program tests. The process of applying the prototype. This process includes first putting one chicken egg into the prototype, then running the program including the egg weight and index, then observing the result listed on the application. Here is the block diagram for our prototype. This is our electronic circuit. This is our flowchart. We use several tests for our prototype, namely field tests, SUS analyze, black box testings, and the last is SWOT analysis. This research succeeds in producing a detection tool from chicken eggs based on egg index and weight using Arduino, which can identify the gender of DOC signs since they are still in the egg phase quickly within a few minutes. The data shows that the load cell weight sensor is working well. It can be seen from egg 3, egg 6, and egg 9 that the sensor can produce data with 100% precision. But in other eggs, there are differences that are not too significant. They have a small range of difference. The data above shows that the two HCSR04 sensors are running well, but the sensors cannot identify the number at the decimal point, so that the number obtained are rounded according to the data above. Rounding of number obtained from the HCSR04 sensor can be rounded up or down. The table above is table of 100 chicken eggs based on the index for database calibration. Based on the data above, it was obtained that the hatchability of the edge was 87.6% or as many as 85 eggs hatched from 95 eggs that fertile. Based on the data obtained from the hatching eggs that have been carried out, it can be categorized as follows, index 1 with weight 1, index 1 with weight 2, and so on. 
after we kept the calibration of the 100x that we have hatched, we use this data to become our database in making our application. We use a codeler application after the tool is tested with fertile chicken eggs, like we did and with data will be sent to the application and will be given the percentage of males and females in the egg tested. From the result of the calculation of the SUS method questionnaire, it was obtained from 20 respondents a total equivalent value of 85.53 with an SUS analyzed value of 85.53 above the average. The classification shows that respondent rate EGUNO as best intended and acceptable. We can conclude that based on the data from the EGUNO test result, it can detect the gender of the chicken eggs with the percentage of male and female chickens. Based on the data from the test result above, the result of some eggs from the sensor measurements can produce data with 100% precision, but in other eggs, there are differences that are not too significant. From the result of the calculation of the SUS method questionnaire, it was obtained total egg unit value of 85.53. That means the tool we made can be used further because it has a high average value. We suggest that it is necessary to test with more chicken eggs so that the data obtained is more accurate. And the last suggestion are the performance of the tools needed to be improved by using ultrasonic sensors and wake sensors in order to have more precise results. With EGUNO, we hope that the X farm industry can be progressed and be able to properly analyze the results of X to be hatched. EGUNO can also be the innovation to get the desired egg results. That's, That's all, all our, our presentations. presentations. Thank, Thank you. you.